My name's Tragedy Watkins, and I've always had an interest in washing machines. Let me show you something. See that gap? That is where our washing machine was. It started clunking. The bearing was gone. I wasn't gonna fix it. Washing machines are dangerous. And it's in the actual drum thing, do you know what I mean? It's in the actual drum thing, boy. You don't want to be meddling with that. Washing machine now, you hear me? So, old hot point's gone off to a new house somewhere, don't know, been giving it away, somebody that can fix it. Jake Cat is not so interested in washing machines. But, what is this? Samsung WW90TA046AE in white, rolls off the tank. We wanted it in grey, but it was out of stock, so we had to get the white one. And boys, our clothes never get washed, really. So I'm gonna peel this peely off and get the bastard thing where it belongs. And then old Gareth, Graham, or whatever. Graham? We have a Graham that watches our unboxings. He doesn't like them. He thinks the demonstrations are stupid. Oh no. I don't mind. And I like washing machines. So, uh. Let's see what it looks like. It's the YouTube hands. The YouTube trademark and boxing hands. It's not really in a box, to be honest with you. It's just wrapped in some fucking plastic shite with some cardboard shite over it. <sighs> Bleh. Bleh. Ah, satisfying. It's got condensation in it. Maybe from the test run. Maybe it's already nice and wet and lubed up ready. Oh yeah. Let's get the schmoo off. In case you didn't know, front, 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 front. Comes with this free piece of wood. Presumably, it's to, is it quite dangerous? Woo! Woo! Ah, oh. oh God, look at that. Oh, it's so shiny and so sexy and it's got this big, Oh yeah, that feels nice. Oh yeah. Oh, 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 play button. Oh, play me the bass off washing machine, please. Play me the laundrettes. Oh, oh touch buttons. Fuck, man. Posh is shit. Samson, in it. Cats, you don't need to hide from the washing machine. It's not going to get you. It might do. Mmm. Mmm. Okay, let's uh, completely unschmoo it. Look at this, you get two lovely pieces of two by one to uh, enjoy and use with your washing machine purchase. So that's nice. Wow. Wow. Whoa. Oh, it did come with one of those. I didn't. I left the old one in place. Oh, look at this. Bridge. It's got a phone holder in it. Yeah, swanky. That's just the right size for a Samsung phone as well. Look at that, look. Ooh. Free moisture with every washing machine. So, uh. Look at this, it's got a mark on it. It's already got a mark on it. Fuck's sake. It's not very good, is it? Okay, never mind. As long as it washes clothes, it's the main thing, isn't it? I kind of hope this lights up. I don't think it does, but it'd be cool if it did. The more LED something has, the better it is. So, here we go. See, we've got to get the old transport bolt, so I'll move it into the utility room before I... Uh, Shoes, 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 those in there. So, 
let's get her into place. Bear with me. Okay, so now that the washing machine's where it needs to be, you gotta get rid of these transport bolts. And as is nicely provided transport bolt removal tool provided by the washing machine people. So, fuck. Let's get this thing off. Look at that beastly bastard. It's like a lumbar puncher for washing machines. Kind of shame there's not really much else you can do with it once it's out. But there we go. That's it, really. Anti-clockwise from up here. In case anyone was wondering. Graham. In case you were wondering, Graham. Is that insightful enough for you? Is it? I don't want to upset you with my useless product unboxings. Did I not unbox it gently enough for you? Did you want to know any micro filters the fucking thing had? Huh? Graham. You know you are. You know you are out there. Mm, why bother with this useless demonstration? He's going to be upset now because I'm going to... Sh demonstrate a washing machine it's going to be interesting for Graham's rock and roll lifestyle oh yeah you can't do lines of speed watching a washing machine I tell you what Graham you fucking can I promise you that anyway let's get the second lumbar puncher out two oh, one more to go and that drum will be free yeah Oh, hang on a minute. Now that those are out, the next thing to do is insert these blanket plates. Because if you don't put these blanket plates in, you'll probably attract wasps and they'll live in your washing machine. They'll get in through these gaps. And if not those small voles, if you're in a rural area, voles maybe, they just really enjoy getting into a washing machine. Oh, God damn it. Hang on a minute. So yeah, we got the blanket plates in. This might be a repeat. I didn't know what was recording or not. Three in there. All right, few Graham. Those are there. Now we're gonna get the waste pipe through this horrible hole I cut up in the corner there. This one. So let me just do that. Then we're gonna take this plug socket. It's funny because whenever people do like oh, showing you the products, oh, it's fitted with a so-and-so plug socket. Like, yeah, it's a plug. You know, how long can people spend talking about a plug? It goes in there. If it doesn't fit, you got the wrong plug. Fit on the thing. Okay. Now I'm going to do the cold water feed, which I left in place from the previous machine, because I can never remember if they provide one or not. I mean, these universal language-free instructions are kind of as clear as mud, aren't they? We've taken the lumbar punctures out the back. We've been this guy here with the question marks. I haven't had a light bulb. I don't need to scan a QR code to borrow a skateboard to move it across the floor. And um, we're not draining it into the sink. Uh, I'm not planning on using it to suck oil out of the ground. Filter. Like what? Do I have to prime the fucking thing maybe? Look! Look! Different socket to the one we just used. How fascinating is that? How mad is that? So, uh, I think that's it really. I don't think I have to um, take anything out of there. There's this blue thing, but it looks like a valvey, valvey thing that lives in there. So, maybe I will scan the QR code so I don't break the washing machine. So nosy. Okay, so no, it doesn't say anything about having to take that out. So yeah, that's obviously meant to be in there. The video from the QR code, by the way, is very, very informative and far more stably filmed than anything I could ever produce. So Graham, you might want to uh, scan this QR code here, either one, and uh, you can watch the lovely corporate uh, video on how to fit and run a washing machine, you know, if the one that you sat through by me was too unstable to watch, maybe. You shouldn't have sat there and watched it. So I'm just going to put the uh, debris on here. I just got to shimmy this back a little bit because the pipe's a bit swing. 
Obviously what is important here is to not uh, cross thread um, the threads as you're putting it on. I um, had to go and do a bit of work yesterday which involved moving the washing machine and redoing this because the person had put it on wonky and it was leaking for ages and they couldn't figure out why. And then a little trick I learned, sorry, I did get a camera thing for Christmas but it didn't work so I had to go back and until I get another one I can't do anything about camera stabilisation. Now a little trick I learned here is because you don't want to do this too tight and you don't want to damage it with grips is to get yourself a rubber glove, a marigold, and use that just to grip it and get it nice and nice and tight on there, you know? Plus what we can do then is we can open the uh, we can open the water valve and uh, happy days will be upon us. Gotta judge the waste pipe onto the thing like this and uh, I don't know where ours has gone. I gotta find it. But you need to, you have to get the metal clip on here, okay? It's really important. It's so important that if you have a flood and uh, your house insurance comes and inspects and there's not a clip on there, you are fucked, okay? Then we turn the water on, like that. And then we just give it a little feel. Mm, nice and dry. Lovely. Alright, well it's sort of in. It's fucking hard work trying to get it in this stupid gap. Such a design flaw. Got anything to say about that, Graham? J Cat's coming to see what he thinks about it. Oh meow, it's new. So I gotta do this calibrate thing, it says. Okay, locked. Let's have a look. So, calibration mode. Press this, little disco comes on. It'll go whoosh, 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 hopefully. Come on, whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Oh fuck, oh it's going, oh my god it's quiet. Wow. Didn't even know it was on then. Whoosh. So look at these modes we got here. Lovely little picture of his sheep, I like that. Oh, dear. Nice little quick wash, mix load, probably what I do, just chuck everything in there. Intense cold, like our winters. Um, colours, bedding, uh, ooh, drum clean, that's good, because I've, I've got a snare drum that's covered in smoo, and it might fit. Drain and spin, rinse and spin, hygiene steam. If I can get my genitals in there. Uh, synthetic cream, cotton, which is not the same as sheep. And uh, eco, which is exciting, isn't it? And then you've got these buttons here, we see temperature, um, the bottom half of the muffin case when you've eaten the top bit of muffin, uh, Cinnabon, um, and one more thing, one more thing, it sings. Look at that. Half a pint. Oh, he's going for it, isn't it? And there you go. It's all done, apparently. 
so happy. So, I don't know, I suppose I'll wash something now. So yeah, Samson washing machine, in, done. Thanks for watching, that's your Graham, in which case I don't care what you think. Bye. Just put it on an empty 15 minute quick wash. See how it judges. Whoa. Just putting the water in. So out of spacey, isn't it? Do you like more cheeses? Yeah. Here are many. Oh, Jesus. Where you get all them from? Oh, where did she get them all from? Are they doing them cheap, are they?